if you are serious about creating a safe and sustainable future for the children, then be serious about education. I hope in another seven years, we will speak to you again. But instead of urging you to help us, we will be cheering and celebrating the progress you have made for girls. Today, Afghanistan is the only country in the world that forbids girls from attending to schools. This week, you are all here to propose solutions to transform education to all. But you must not forget those who left behind, those who are not lucky enough to be at school at all. Show your solidarity with me and millions of Afghan girls. Our contribution is a call to action for everyone. Colleagues, we need more national budgets allocated to learners with disabilities. We demand an intersectional approach based on principles of human rights, sustainable development, gender equality, climate justice, inclusion, diversity, but most of all, solidarity. Without education, where would I be? What and where would any of us be? How many roads must a man walk down before you can call him a man? How many seas does a white dove sail? The answer is long.